For this lesson, I'm going to go over dividing decimals. Um, so for right now, we have 0 and 28 thousandths divided by 0 and 5 tenths. Uh, so we will set up the problem as if we are doing a standard long division problem. So I will put the dividend divided by the divisor. Okay. Then we move the decimal place of the divisor. We are multiplying it by a power of 10 in order to make the divisor a whole number. So if we move the decimal point 1 to the right on the divisor, we move it 1 to the right on the dividend. Okay. Second step, bring up the decimal. That's where the decimal point will be in your quotient. Okay, then we go ahead and start dividing with the standard long division method. So we ask, does 5 go into 0? doesn't go into 0. It does not go into 2. Okay, so we have to put a 0 here. 0 times 5 is 0. Subtract, you get 2. Bring down the 8. 5 goes into 28 5 times. 5 times 5 is 25. Subtract, you get 3. Now, you must keep going until you get a remainder 0. Remainder of 0 is the goal. Therefore, we must keep going. Because it's a decimal, we can add zeros to the end and it will not change the value of the dividend. Now we can go ahead and divide 5 into 30. It goes in 6 times. 6 times 5 is 30. Subtract and you get your remainder 0. So the quotient for this division problem is 0 and 56 thousandths.